Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Ashwini and today we are going to see 1st PUC Chapter 1 Important Questions. So here in this video I have explained all the questions from 2014 to 2019 question paper, final exam question paper. So in this first chapter overview of computer we have totally 8 marks. You will get one question for 1 mark, 1 question for 2 marks and 1 question for 5 marks. Totally it is 8. From 2014 to 2019. So here is the 1 mark questions. So you can see give the expansion of IC, give the expansion of VLSI. So both is asked in 2014 and 2014 supplementary. In 2015 they have asked about expanding IC which is the earliest computer machine 2015 supplementary they have asked. So all these are different questions. So concentrate on one marks when you want to get complete marks. So complete 70 marks if you want to get you have to concentrate on one mark question because most of you all you will get 67, 68 because of this one marks you lose one or two marks in your final exam do not do that always concentrate on one marks also you cannot identify which question you will get for one mark probably like the first two three chapters whatever you have in that one mark question you fail to answer it the remaining programming part it is fine everyone will attend it but the starting whatever the hardware concepts part you have there you can't identify which questions you are going to get. So concentrate on one marks for the first first three four chapters. So these are the one mark question. Mark the questions. This is the two mark question from 2014 to 2019. So here almost they have asked about the generations, different generations, different components of different generations. They have asked about the computer used in education role, science role. They have asked about ENIAC applications they have asked. So computer role in science and technology, two applications of computer in education. So almost in all the like almost four times they have asked role of computer in education field. So remember all the generations, all the components remember the characteristics as well as applications of computer here features of computers in different generations so features or write a note on any of the generation they can ask you so remember these points this one is your 5 mark question so here almost they have asked about the application they have asked about the characteristics and block diagram. So you can see the third question, the fourth question you have about the block diagram. The second question and the sixth question are the characteristics. Then you have about the generations, remaining all the questions is about the generation. And the last one in 2015 they have asked one write a note on history of computer. So in 5 mark question you need to remember the characteristics, you need to remember all the generations, all the 5 generation, you need to remember the block diagram, that particular question, you need to remember the different computer, types of computers. So you need to remember the micro computer, mini computer, mainframe computer, super computers, even that question they can ask for 5 mark. So all these four, 4 to 5 questions if you study in first chapter you will get the complete 5 mark there. So whatever you studied the generations same thing they can ask you in 2 mark also. If you study the complete thing it will be helpful for both 2 mark and 5 mark. So remember these questions and study these questions. I hope you like this video. If you have any doubts on any of the question please leave a comment. 
I will answer you as soon as possible. If you like this video, please hit a like, share it with your friends and please don't forget to subscribe my channel. Thank you.